embryo cloning. It's different from adult cell cloning. In adult cell cloning, you're trying to clone an organism that is already in existence and with characteristics that you would like to have. So you take one of those cells from the adult and you clone it. Embryo cell cloning, you don't actually clone the organism with the characteristic you want, such as this cow. What you assume is that its offspring will have very good characteristics, particularly if you breed it with a bull with very good characteristics. And then the idea is you'll have lots of those offspring that you would like to be able to clone at the same time. So in order to do this process, you need this cow to super ovulate, to produce lots of eggs. And you can do that by injecting fertility hormones into the cow, such as follicle stimulating hormone, FSH. Once the cow has received, for a period of time, those hormones, the cow will super ovulate. In other words, it will produce lots of eggs from its ovaries, which you can either then mate the cow with a bull, or you can harvest the eggs from the ovary. Once you've got hold of the eggs, you then need to fertilize each egg. And then once the eggs have been fertilized, they will then divide into embryos, as you see here. Now, these embryos are genetically different from each other. They're of different eggs, fertilized with different sperm. What you can do at this stage is then to genetically screen them for the characteristics you want, or just take a bit of potluck and then proceed by cloning these embryos. How you do that? that you would take one of these embryos and then you separate it out into individual cells. Now these cells are stem cells which means that the embryos or the, the cells will just continue to divide into new embryos again as I've shown you here but all of them will do it as well. Now all of these all of these are now genetically identical to each other they originated from the same egg, fertilized by the same sperm. All you have to do now is to grow them, and that means you need some surrogate cows. They don't have to be the same cow that donated the egg, just the same species. So we're going to pop these embryos into the uterus of each cow. They should implant and then, after a period of time later, each cow will give birth to a calf. But those calves will not be the genetic offspring of these surrogate mothers. They will be the genetic offspring of the original cow that donated the egg and the bull that donated the sperm. So they are clones of each other. They're clones from the same embryo. Hence, embryo cloning.